On Tuesday, September 11th, Big Sandy Community and Technical College's Pikeville campus hosted a 9-11 memorial event for students and faculty. This year's focus was more about what happened rather than why it happened due to younger generations being born after the 9-11 tragedy. Speakers at the event also talked about how 9-11 shaped our country into what it is today. Big Sandy Community Technical College has a long tradition of supporting the 9-11 memorial. With this particular iteration of the 9-11 memorial with the 23rd anniversary, we're going to focus more on what happened rather than why it happened. We realize that we have students that may not have been alive during the time of the 9-11 attacks. We're going to talk about remembrance, we're going to talk about service, and we're going to talk about lessons learned from this event in a retrospective way so that the students can see what happened uh, rather than having to feel what happened like some of the uh, older generation would. Journey into the extraordinary hideaway novelties, smoke and vape, the finest selection of vapes, glass, edibles, and more, Cole Run Caney and South Williamson. With how information spreads today, it's important to preserve the facts about 9-11 without introducing political bias. Preservation is key to giving younger generations perspective about the status of the world. I think students today, in, in the traditional student sense, coming right out of high school, they consume their information in much different ways than your uh, millennial generation or your generation X or prior to that. So we have to understand that they're consuming knowledge that may have implicit bias attached to it that they might not see. So we try to give them a non-biased approach to view this information, um, to formulate their own understandings of events that have happened to help shape the structure of what they're in today. So why do we have certain rules and regulations associated um, with their education, with their work, with their religious practices, with so on and so forth. So I think it gives students a perspective of um, why some of the things that they might not understand are shaped the way they are. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Nick Collum.